Good evening, everyone. Welcome to tonight's broadcast of the NBA All-Star Game. Alongside Clark Kellogg and Steve Kerr, this is Kevin Harlan. Well, we know basketball is a game that's all about team success and team achievement, even here in the NBA. But this game, the All-Star Game, gives a nod to the great individual talents this league has to offer. And those talents will be showcased in an entertaining fashion here today. Yeah, a lot of fun to watch, isn't it? Yes, sir. Yeah, it is. And it gives these players that spotlight and recognition that they so rightfully deserve, thanks to their terrific play during the regular season. And, of course, their important contributions to their teams. A look at the West All-Stars starting group. Clark, he's in a point guard. Kawhi Leonard is out there with DeMarcus Cousins. Then there's Russell Westbrook. And it's Davis in at the small forward position. <laughs> That's exactly why you watch the All-Star game. To see plays just like that. Well, I guess you'd call this weekend maybe the greatest pickup game on earth. Does, <laughs> does that make sense, Clark? It sure does, and I agree with you. I mean, there's no doubt it tops the list, partner. You know, I think one thing that makes the All-Star game so special is just the history involved. This event has been held since 1951, and a lot of those legends of the NBA past are here in attendance. The All-Star festivity is always a big draw for VIPs, stars, and celebrities, and I see quite a few in the house tonight. Yeah, really a festive atmosphere around this event and this weekend. There's just so much going on, both on and off the court. Shot clock at five. Baseline jumper, and he drops that one in. And just over a minute played here in the start of the game. Now it's in it down to Doris Burke, who was able to talk with head coach Steve Clifford. Talking to Coach, he said that this is one of the few times he's not had to worry about defense hitting into a game. Coach said, it's nice knowing that the more scoring there is, the better it is for the game, and the better it is for us, guys. Thank you, Doris. James sets the screen for Wall. It's LeBron with the drive. That's good. And so Wall with the assist. James has got his first two points. And so here are the West All-Stars. Here's Clark. And that one's good. Clark. Clark's got his second bucket of the night. And we're seeing right here the defense is definitely optional. Yeah, and we're seeing which option the players are taking. <laughs> <laughs> now here is Irving. Four-point game. The drive by James. And he gets the bucket. James has got his second basket. He's hit the ground running here in the first, putting together a nice quarter offensively. First quarter of ball, almost two and a half minutes in. Clark kicks to Leonard. Well, you can't expect lockdown D in the All-Star game, especially in the first half. And here we go with John Wall. Feeds it to Carmelo. Fades back. And he overshot that one, missing. Well, I think the defense got lucky right there. I mean, he's going to make a lot more of those than he misses when he's got that much room. Here comes Westbrook. On the wing, Davis. Westbrook against Wall. From the wing. No good. The East All-Stars go the other way with it. And down it goes. Dunk through off a wonderful assist. I'd say that fast break went according to plan. Yeah, it sure did. A good job getting it started. And a better job finishing it off. Now here's Westbrook. There's the dish to Cousins. Here's Clark. Foul call that time on the way up. That'll give him two chances at the free throw line here. And let's get your take, guys, on the scoring breakdown for the West All-Stars. They've been making some really nice passes out there. Excellent passing. That could set the tone for the rest of the game. 
Yeah, and the, the fact that they're playing well, close to the hoop, finding points in the paint, I mean, they've got it all going tonight. Kevin Love's checked in for Paul George. Well, playing in the All-Star game, something to really be proud of. And, of course, the starters are voted in by the fans. The reserves are voted in by the coaches. Either way, it's a heck of an honor. Second free throw, no good. Steve, you talk about the starters and the reserves, unlike in regular games. In an all-star game, everyone gets a chance to play. Yeah, and I think the hardest part for the coaches, Kevin, is distributing those minutes because everybody is deserving. Everyone's a great player. And usually what happens is the starters get the most minutes because the coaches understand that that's the, who the fans have voted on there, and that's, uh, that's who they want to see. Now here's James after the miss from Clark. Great tee that time from Davis. Well, those chances are almost always two points for him. I, I guess the defense did what it had to do to bother him. Westbrook against Wall. Cousins inside. Hits the jump hook. Cousins has got his second bucket of the night. Really nice work inside there. He'll always give you a battle on the interior, guys. It's Wall with the drive. Quick shot there, and it's off target. And here's the West with the ball. Three-point lead. There's the lob to the hoop. Stolen away. Nice job to interrupt the alley-oop attempt there. James outside. Outside Irving. Good, and the assist goes to James. Irving's got five points so far. Well, when you know where your teammate is going to be, it, it doesn't make it a difference whether it's a, a, a normal game in the regular season or at All-Star Weekend. I, I agree with you. I mean, they play well as teammates, and you're going to just naturally make plays with guys that you're used to playing with here. Clark's gone three for four here from the field. So both teams making some changes here. All right, let's go over to the sideline with Doris Burke. Guys, over that last break, I listened to Doc Rivers address his team. The first thing he said to his players was that the trans... He wants them to push the tempo at every opportunity. There was something else he mentioned, too. He wants them to utilize the pick and roll as much as possible in their coming possessions. So still in the opening quarter and already some adjustments being made. Back to you, Kevin. Great. Thanks for the report, Doris. And here is Curry. He lobs it up. Kicks it out to Harden. Here's Jordan. And he gets it to go. Jordan's got his first bucket in this one. That rebound and the follow kind of typify what he's all about. Just gritty, determined play. Lucas with it. And Curry picks him up defensively. Lucas the pass to Nixon. And foul called as he misses. He'll go to the line and shoot two. It's going to be on James Harden. These Dall Stars shooting their first free throws of the game right now. And that one misses. It's the second from the line. Here's Curry. 102 left to play in the first quarter. Curry gets the screen from Clark. Curry dishes to Harden. 
Looking for Aldridge, he gets it there. On the money from 12 feet away. Really did a nice job recognizing the mismatch that he had and uh, immediately cashing in with that mid-range jumper. Dishes it to Lucas. There's 42 seconds left in the first quarter of the game. Curry gets the bucket. Curry's got his first points of the night. Well, you know, he's obviously a very popular player, but look at the numbers for his team that he's put up this year. Just outstanding. Yeah, I couldn't agree more, Steve. He's been making it happen, clearly focused, and I know he's looking to continue that effort for the second half of the season as well. Here is Lucas following the basket by Stephen Curry. Bullard, the pass to Wolf. Now the feed to Love. Here's Bullard. That falls. Great assist by Love. Everybody on the floor is hot. Incredible stuff here in the early stages. Tell you what, both teams playing downhill. Who's going to blink first? Aldridge kicks to Clark. Outside Curry. East grabs the miss. Most of the time, that shot will go down. Boy, the defenders have to make sure they tag it. A free-flowing first quarter. Great scoring through one. West All-Stars out in front. They're up by five. And the second quarter will get underway just after this short break. 